あんまのおごりですが大王様に呼ばれましたねいいあんまだいいよあんまさん評判通りの腕利きだな出るでお前もやってもらえい,いえ私は結構ですいいから脱げやあんたこんなとこにいたら長生きでいいねさっさと逃げなはいやるでーあの世でやったらまた頼むなあんまあっちが天国こっちが地獄で土地区できれば現世に戻ってやり残したことがあるカニ神様もむごいの人をガキ闇の姿に変えて何を試そうとしておられるのか蘇生の湯は大蛇の泉の果てにある知りたい教えてくださいあ,のあるビッグバジェットの企画があってそれがあのクランクインの I actually had one big budget project that got cancelled a month before we were supposed to begin shooting then after that I didn't really feel like working for a little while And then I traveled up to Kumano region of Japan, to the Kumano Kodo, the Kumano Path. And uh, it's a place that's really filled with <coughs> nature and it has a mystical feeling. And I went to travel through there. And then when, I, when you, I got through the Kumano Kodo, there was an onsen, there was a hot spring called Tsuboyu. And I got in, it was really amazing. And on the wall of the, of the hot spring, the legend of this, uh, of this rebirth was written on that wall. The Jodo Sun. Uh, since I, it was after this big budget project had fallen through, I really wanted to just make a film, even if it was just low budget, just go ahead and make a film. And so three months after that trip, I was already working towards uh, uh, pre-production. I might have even started shooting by three months later. Of course, it's a budget problem. <laughs> I understood that we could manage about 10 days of shooting through the budget. And um, I think the tip is, is the secret is, is to basically chip away at your sleeping time. I'm sure that if the events of five years ago never happened, I would not have made a film that deals thematically with rebirth and uh, resuscitation and revival. So in a way, I was trying to just reverse the reversed circumstances in a way. Um, and as far as what would have happened if that incident didn't occur, I did have three big budget projects all get cancelled. So I did also cause inconvenience to various uh, production companies as well. And I think if it hadn't happened, I would have made those films and I'd be a very rich man now. Uh, for this film, I watched a lot of uh, works by Kenji Mizoguchi, so I would say that I was very influenced by his works. But I also do love the films of Tchaikovsky. So Twin Tales is a band that I participated in, I, I was part of um, during my period of not working, and it's a band with myself. and. Also, uh, Nakamura, who is, plays the main character in the film, as well as Katsui on electric violin and Terui on bass. And I participated with visuals. And, um, I want, and we would do shows and rock festivals together. And uh, I wanted to make something with them that was not a promotional video or a music video. I wanted to make something, a film with them that was not those things. And so this film really exists because of the band. Twin Tales is an uh, improvisational band, so they have no music, they have no written songs, and so all live performances are all done improvised. And so um, I have picked up some of the songs, I have recorded some of the songs that they have performed throughout various live performances and used that as a concept to um, shoot the film. And then after the film was shot and edited, then I asked for specific kinds of music to go along with it. And that music also was all improvised and recorded all in one day, and then it was the film was re-edited with that music. I really have no idea what kind of reaction the American audience will have. <laughs> the reason why I don't know is um, this happened also with European audiences as well, and I showed it to them, but um, they don't have the same faith in the spirit and in the ghost of a person um, as, as Japanese people do. Japanese people um, have faith in the presence of a human spirit, um, but I think American audiences 
probably like European audiences don't have that faith. So um, I think it's going to be a very different point of view that looks at this film. So I think if the audience can view it as the power of nature, something mystical and powerful, inherent in Earth, maybe it's a little bit occult-like. Um, and I would also like them to watch a film as if they were listening to music. He still has things left to do. And I think it's because I personally also believe I have things left to do here. お前は。そのままで十分綺麗だよ。ありがとう。出るで。俺来たよな。お前が逃げれんのはあの世だけだって。これは人間の再生と愛の始まりの物語。よみがえりの地。この世で治らぬ病を。あの世で治せ。